Hi everyone, welcome back to Trini Kids TV. My name is Auntie Shade and it's nice of you to join us. Now before we get started, there's something that we have to do. Yes, we have to sing our good morning song. So let's sing our good morning song together. Are you ready? Let's go. Good morning, good morning, good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning, it's nice to see you too. Good morning, good morning, good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning, it's nice to see you too. And a very good morning to all of you that are watching. Now, let's see the days of the week and the months of the year. Now, who can guess what day it is today? I'll give you a hint. It starts with the letter M. Did you guess? It's Monday. Today is Monday. Can we say that in a sentence? Today is Monday. Very good. Now, let's sing the days of the week. The days of the week are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Very good. Now, who can guess what month we are in? It's a new, new month. We said goodbye to October. Bye, October. And now there's a brand new month. Can you guess what it is? It's the month of November. We are in the month of November and we are very close to the end of 2020. Can you believe it? So let's sing the months of the year. Let's go. The months of the year are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Great job, everyone. Let's talk about the weather. But first, we have to sing our weather song. Can you sing the weather song with me? Okay, let's go. What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like today, today? What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like today? Is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? What's the weather like today? Is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? What's the weather like today? A very, very rainy day. And on a rainy day, we need to keep ourselves from getting wet. What do you think we can use? Yes, that's right. We can use an umbrella or we can use a raincoat. Okay, so let's talk about our color of the day and our shape of the day. Now, our color of the day is the color orange. And our shape is a circle. Can you see that? A circle. Can you find something orange at home? Great job, everyone. So our shape of the day is a our letter of the day is the letter J. That's a letter that comes after I. Now J, the area of the day for J is Jerningham, Jerningham Junction. That's two J's. And Jerningham Junction is a village located in Canopia. That's in Chaguanas. Jerningham Junction has two main schools. There's Canopia High School, which is also right next to the Jerningham Junction Primary School. Jerningham Junction is a residential area, but you can take a drive to Jerningham if you're ever in the central area or maybe you're from Jerningham yourself. So today we are going to be talking about ways that we can keep our bodies healthy. Now we all know that the coronavirus is in Trinidad and Tobago and many places around the world. And one of the ways that we can help keep ourselves healthy and strong so that we can protect ourselves from getting sick from the coronavirus is by eating healthy. 
right? And that's what we are going to be talking about today. Now, we are going to be talking about our five food groups. Five, just like our fingers. So, can we count to five? One, two, three, four, five. So we have five food groups, right? So, we're going to talk about the five food groups. We have five food groups, just like we have five fingers. And in those five food groups, there is dairy, grains, proteins, fruits and vegetables yes so auntie's going to show you an example of all those food groups first i have my grains food group and i'm going to put my grains there can you see my grains i have bread i have grains i have cornmeal i have nuts all these different things and these make up the grains healthy grains that you can eat now I'm sure you can see some grains that you would normally eat all the time like black eyed peas lentils chana red beans and split peas right so I'm going to stick my grains onto my my little circle that I drew here so that we can see all the five fruit groups together next I'm going to stick my fruits now I have a lots of fruits here. I have mangoes, I have bananas, I have pomerac, pom cite, cherries, apples, grapes. And there's so many fruits in Trinidad and Tobago that we can enjoy, right? So Auntie just included just a few, but there are lots of fruits that we can enjoy. Okay, so this is one of our food groups. I'm going to add it here. Our next food group is vegetables now i know we all love vegetables right right so i have some eggplant or bygone here i have some carrots some corn some pumpkin some cucumbers some lettuce tomatoes and a whole bunch of other things now i'm sure we can think of lots of fruits and vegetables Next, I have my dairy. Now, dairy would be milk, butter, cheese, yogurt. So, those are important things, right? All right, so I added my dairy section. And I have one more section to add. That's my protein. Now, protein, you can get it from chicken, fish, beef, goat, duck, lamb, all the different meats. You can also get it from nuts and eggs, okay? Let's take a look. Look at that, you can see my beautiful food groups. I have my protein here. I have my vegetables, my dairy, my grains, and my fruits over here. And you see there are lots of delicious foods that we can eat every day, right? Okay, everyone, well, I'm just going to show you like a quick, nice example of some a sandwich that you could probably have that includes a lot of the food groups, okay, or a breakfast sandwich, right? So I have my two slices of whole wheat bread. This will be for my grains. I'm going to add some cheese, a slice of cheese, which will be my dairy. See that? And I have tomatoes, my pretend tomatoes. I'm going to add that to my sandwich. Can you see? Right. My tomatoes. And I'm going to add some lettuce. So that's my vegetables, right? And I can close up my sandwich. And mm, look at that. My pretend sandwich is looking really good. Now you can make a real sandwich at home. That would be really nice. And you can have this with probably a banana or some fruit juice like grape and so on so that you can get all five of your fruit groups so you see how simple it is to eat healthy at home so we can try we try our best to include lots of the food groups so that we are getting all of our nutrients our vitamins our minerals to grow healthy and strong okay Thank you for so much for joining us on Trini Kids TV once again. We're so happy to have you. Be sure to like and subscribe and share with all of your friends. Can't wait to see you tomorrow. Bye.